participating in vlogmas so you go you know that means i post every single day for december uh, up until the 25th so it's been a time but it's been really good i will say that yeah i was just gonna ask like do you do those videos ahead of time or are they like in the moment so a lot of them were ahead of time i had them pre-scheduled pre-filmed only thing i needed to do was really add on like the end screen and then upload them but yeah. now we're getting down to doing like two a day to catch up and make sure I have one ready for the next day and then also filming the same day. So, yeah, it's not fun. <laughs> so how do you feel about your trip? Have you been able to kind of devote attention to it at all? Or is it just like back burner because of everything else that's going on? It's kind of been back burner, but I have had inquiries coming in just like DMs asking questions further wanting to, you know, get a little more comfortable and understanding of what they're booking for and stuff. So um, yeah. also a few emails and whatnot. And I think people are just like kind of in between shopping right now and then booking. You know, it can be tough to sell during the holidays for mm -hmm. some demographics, especially like, you know, people with families or if they're traveling a lot for Christmas. Mm -hmm. But we have historically seen December actually be a really great month for confirming trips. Definitely don't count it out in terms of like, oh, I'm just not going to promote until January. Um, I definitely think that there's room for people to book still in this month. So this is the data that we have access to on the back end in terms of trip promotion and then bookings to help you make, you know, decisions about what type of content to share and how to share it. Mm -hmm. So this doesn't mean that you haven't promoted. It just means that whatever promotion you maybe were doing, it wasn't enough to get people to go to the trip page. Mm -hmm. um, and I think what I want to do, since you are so busy, is prioritize your time in the place where I think you're going to get the most traction. So my number one is just make it easier to find the link on Instagram, even if you're not doing active promotion, to have it there passively allows people to do some of their own research and look into it. What I worry about is that if you wait until January to promote again, that you will have lost so much momentum, mm -hmm. you'll be kind of starting over again. I understand yeah. what it looks like in terms of marketing and just like consistency and knowing that dropping the ball can be a reason for the slow to come, but I'm faithful that it's going to happen because we're three in and I think we can definitely get the rest of them on board like next week. Well, have a wonderful holiday. Um, I'll probably check in with you before the end of the week, just lightly in a text to be like, how's it going? Obviously, I'm keeping an eye on Instagram, um, the closest, but if I see something on YouTube, I'll be stoked. I kind of check every day to see if you have any other bookings. So, um, yeah, very excited for you, and I know that you can do it 100%. Okay, yes, for sure. Hey, you guys, happy Vlogmas Day 19. So let's chat really quick about what you guys were able to see just now on my call and a little bit of what you probably heard. So very exciting news that I have not shared over here on YouTube just yet. Your girl is hosting a trip. So you, me, and everybody else that you love will be in Costa Rica next July of 2024. Now, I did announce this over on my Instagram page, but I have not gotten a chance with my Virgo extra perfectionist gotta do everything a certain way self to promote it over here but I do want to go ahead and just 
open up and tell you guys about the trip because as you can see vlogmas has had me in a chokehold okay and i have not been able to really get any of my sit down videos done but i will be doing one to kind of answer a lot of the questions that you guys may have on this video so be sure to put them down below so anywho I'm hosting a trip, Travel Trip has sponsored me and they're allowing me to take 20 of my family members here on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, wherever you may come from on a trip to Costa Rica. We're gonna be there for seven days and we are going to have a ball. A few of my friends will be attending the trip so you guys will get to meet me and them. And I was really kinda, apprehensive about doing this because I was like oh I've always made it when I get to 100k I'm gonna have my meet and greet I don't want to rush that but I could not pass up the opportunity to do one of the things that I love to do which is travel and then be able to interact and really engage with you guys so I said you know what to hell with it if you guys remember the vlog where I was headed home to Augusta and I stopped at Chick-fil-a to get on a call this was the call so the agent that I'm working with she is so super sweet I actually changed over from the last girl to Ashley and yeah we've just been really chopping it up on these calls just about strategy how to promote how to market and I really was telling her I don't want to be tone deaf during the holiday season where I'm not paying attention to what people may be having going on with shopping and buying food to host whatever the case may be and throwing my trip out there like hey forget everything else go ahead and put your deposit down for the trip but hell if y'all gonna travel y'all gonna travel so this is an open invitation to everyone i will have the link down below in the pinned comment and like i said if you guys have any questions that were not answered over on my instagram highlight because i have a highlight on my page go check that out first then be sure to ask them down below and i will be sure to get back to you or just address your question in the sit down video that i'm going to post later on this week we gotta do it we gotta rip the band-aid off and we have to do it so she was saying that she's very confident in my ability to confirm a trip and just to confirm I need about eight travelers right now I have three full transparency moment okay I launched on November 30th and from my launch I haven't said anything else to you guys because the next day started vlogmas and girl we've been busy but I have to get back on it because I know better I run a business I know about promo and marketing so I don't know why I'm sitting up here acting scared to really pub my trip and say like hey we're going to costa rica you guys come along because i know a lot of you would love the opportunity to and i had a very high ranking for the amount of people who signed up just to get the details on my trip so there's no reason why i'm scaling back being weird about you guys coming on this trip with me but like i said i just have a funny way of wanting to do things and i wasn't able to sit down and have that like big reveal video with you guys so yeah here i am coming to y'all in a vlogmas video because this is real life and this what the hell be going on and sometimes things won't be perfect but they got to be done so yeah, you guys, welcome to another day of Vlogmas. I'm actually gonna sit down and get some editing done and I'll pick back up with you guys once I get to a really good stopping point. But as of right now, for me and mine, we got to get this work done. Phew. Okay, so y'all remember me telling y'all in yesterday's video that I would be sharing all of the gifts that I picked up for my family for Christmas because I randomly sat down on Sunday and decided to order everything, but I did not cross check with everybody to make sure that we weren't buying duplicates and that's exactly what happened because why me and my dad got the exact same gift from my mom? When I tell you I am sick, like he literally called me first thing this morning was just like, so what you picked up for your mom? And I was like, ah. What you gotta? And he told me that he got the same gift and his is actually delivering today. So I couldn't even argue. I couldn't even argue and he's so sweet. He was just like, well, I'll take mine back. You go ahead and give it to her. I was like, no, it's okay. I can make a run to the store. With that being said, mama, if you are watching, go ahead and exit the group chat for me because I don't want to hear that I spoiled your Christmas. Anyway, I'm gonna run to Alta because she wants this Burberry Her perfume gift set and I was going to order it from Dillard's, but 
they weren't going to be able to deliver it until the 28th and then the closest dealers to me that has it yeah girl it's not so close so we're just gonna go ahead and run to Ulta because I'm sure they have if anything the big bottle and I'll supplement with other things because who uses the lotions from the perfume set still no shade if you do but I just want to know like is it worth getting the entire set because I can't tell you the last time I saw Cheryl take one of them perfume lotions and lathered it on her body it's been a while like probably since middle or high school so whatever that's a gift that you want I'm gonna try to find it in there but if not we gonna supplement and get other things around that bottle so I also need to make a run to Target. I have some paper towels that I need to pick up. I made myself a list yesterday while I was walking the aisles of Lidl. Nobody told me that we needed sour cream. Well, some more because we ate that chili last night. Mm -hmm. Girl, don't worry. I'm gonna make another bowl tonight. And then um, we also need some K-cups because I'm running low for my coffee. I told y'all I've been on a coffee kick. For vlogmas and juice jiffy mix and there's something else i'm drawing a blank but yeah i'm not sure if i want to get all this stuff from target but i do want to get the paper towels from target unless i make a pickup order for costco does costco do pickup orders because y'all know i'm just now renewing my membership since pre-covid so i wonder do they i don't know i need to look into that but I think that's just about it. Let me not sit up in this car and ramble because it's 11 o'clock right now. And I already took some time out of my morning schedule so that I can post about the trip over on Instagram. And I'm planning to sit down today so I can film the video for you guys just about all of the questions that y'all may have. Like I said earlier, I do want to cross promote in any way that I can because I have different followers on different platforms who may not see other things when other things are posted. So um i have plans to do that and i'm hoping that i can get it all done today but if not that can be the first thing that i do in the morning but that call really kind of put me in the perspective of shanice there you go you're self-sabotaging do not do that to yourself stay on top of the things that you need to stay on top of so that you can get the best results that's what i wanted to sit down and get done today if you guys are over on instagram then you've already seen it and everything will be in the highlight on my profile and the link will also be in the bio just to put that out there but it's also in the pinned comment here okay i already told y'all that let me get on the road Ooh. i got right ice all right, so I just pulled up to Ulta and the parking lot is nasty. It's 11.30. I mean, I guess, you know, once again, I'm not the only one with the idea to come to the store first thing on a Tuesday morning. And I'm not the only one who works from home either, huh? So yeah, I do want to take a little, you know, peruse around Kirkland, but I'm trying to chill. I'm trying to chill. I'm trying to chill. We gotta be home by one. 30. Oh, while I'm in here, I also wanted to look for the e.l.f. lip oil. I hear they have a lip oil and I was also watching Chelsea Janae's vlog and she said that they have like a dupe for the Laneige lip mask. Y'all know how they have them in like the lip gloss tubes. So I want to look for that too. e.l.f. has really been that girl. I remember before I could really afford to just be out here buying skincare like that e.l.f used to come in handy i still use their holy hydration for the eye cream and the facial cream and i also have like a cleanser or two from them for travel purposes like the smaller sizes but yeah elf ain't never been the one to play weed Ugh. let me smell this paradox intense i hear it smells really good and i already have the original so let's see Ooh, they have one more bottle left. This does smell good. Hi, do you not have any more of the Burberry curve? Whatever is out, that's all we have. That's it? Okay. Yeah. Yes. We have the test if you want to smell it. Okay, thank you. Y'all, here are the Laneige dupes by Elf. And evidently they're good because they're the last two up here. Y'all, they only had a few left, so I got two of the 
crystal clear and then I got one that is a red delicious the OGs remember but this is the original Ulta Beauty lip oil that I have been getting for years I've been off of it since because the packaging be a little weird it'd be leaking through in my purses hey yo, how are you good Thank you so much. You have a good one. Have a good one. Girl, unsuccessful. I ain't do nothing but shop for myself. I literally only picked up a bunch of glosses. I did get my grandma a fancy gloss bomb because she loves those things and I think when we was in New York she pulled out her fussy and it was really low so my mom told me that I could pick her up one of those but that's not a real Christmas gift girl that's like a little stocking stuffer but see the thing about my grandparents is that they don't be asking for anything of course so I still wanted to get her that nice little philosophy set but she has so much of it left over so now i'm just gonna get back on dillard's and order the perfume set there and i can just go pick it up because i'm not about to be running around like a chicken with my head cut off for these gifts last minute because uh -oh. okay chaotic but yeah mm -mm. You know what, I wasn't even thinking. Before I check out from Dillard's, I'm about to run into Kohl's because it's right here by Ulta and they may have the gift set in there because it's available online. They might just not have the inventory update, you know what I'm saying? And they have a Sephora in here as well, so I might catch my luck. But girl, let me try out this little um, lip oily oil. What am I doing? I really feel like I'm about to enjoy this a little too much. That's why I picked up so many. But look at how small and cute it is. OMG. It's so cute. And then the applicator. She's that girl. Oh. I was looking at it online and I seen how thick and luscious this is. If I'm not mistaken, the Dior lip oil applicator looks like this. But don't get me to lying because I know Ashley had one and I think it was thick and just luscious like this. Mm. It kind of has like a minty little situation going on. And it says that it's infused with apricot oil. Now this is the Red Delicious and it really doesn't have a tint to it. It's just glossy and I love that. I figured it wouldn't have a tint for real. But yes, let me go ahead and add this to my purse because y'all know I've been tripping with the lip products lately. So yeah, we need that. Y'all, I want to splurge on this serum so so bad they do have this little set down here but i just want the serum because i've used this before in the past they used to sell it in ulta a while back and i think they still have it in select ulta stores but that is so 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 good this is the laneige one that i was telling you guys i got that elf dupe for because they come in the exact same little squeeze tubes but these are 17 dollars Y'all, my mom brought this to New York with her. And when I say I used it every single morning, it's the Rice Wash by Tatcha. And it's so good. Sidebar, you guys know the Versed Body Scrub that I've been picking up lately? It's a dupe for this. The first time I used it, I was like, this seems very familiar. And you guys remember, I've been using this too, girl. This is why I can't come to the store because I'm in here doing stuff for me. But I want to try out the blur stick so bad but i don't even know what shade i would be in because in ease drop i'm one thing in the pro filter i'm another and i feel like my shade right here between 18 and 21 is sold out because they don't have the testers out thank you so much y'all i'm crashing out i'm crashing out i'm crashing out because i have not bought anything for anybody else except for me i'm about to go home and get back to shopping online because see this is why i don't come to the store because how did i end up with that serum hmm? 
Like, <sighs> I'm just so confused as to my recent actions. Like, Shanice, it's not making sense. You came to Christmas shop for your mom and your grandma and your granddaddy. How did you get that in the bag? Hmm? Like, just let me know. Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. Because this isn't about you. This isn't about you. Like, yeah, gift yourself, girl, by all means. But <sighs> it's getting foolish. Because it's dope. All right. We got to get some gas. Because we've driven across the country two times since the last time I filled up, which is quicker than normal. One, we went to Douglasville, and then the other day I went to Swanee. So, girl, my gas tank, like, who? Who? Who you thought was finna last off of that? And then I am going to run into Costco because I'm gonna grab some paper towel while I'm here. Might as well, might as well. I'm in the area, I'm in the neighborhood. Sorry about that. Oh, chat. Child, I'm too nosy for my own business, so he back there fussing at her. Hold on, let me close the door before I get fussed at too. Um, girl, she back there getting fussed at because y'all know it's a one way when you come down stuff like this. Now she done bust a U-turn to go the opposite direction so she can put the hump in her car, honey. And he's telling her like, ma'am, you know this a one way? You know better than that. See, black folk, we like to bend the rules to make the rules work for us, but this is not BP. Okay? This is not QC. This is not none of the above. This is Costco. This is the elite. We have to have a membership to come here. Please act correct. Please act correct. Do not come in here with that ghetto shit. Meanwhile, here I am with the whole plate from my salt fish and bake earlier that I had on the way to <laughs> Ulta. Girl, let me go ahead and throw this away and mind my business. And y'all know what's funny about older people who be working at these establishments. They do not care. So what's on their mind, they're going to say. And that man is really still out there fussing the girl and drove off and everything acting like she ain't know this was a one way. Ma'am. Ma'am. That old man said, I don't care nothing about that. I'm finna fuss at you. I'm finna fuss at you because you know. <laughs> so let me just go ahead and put it out there. I'm not going to Target. Because the way I just showed out in Sephora and Ulta. Because why am I shopping for myself? I had no business buying anything for me. And it's already 1 o'clock. So I'm going to run in here and get these paper towel. I may get some sour cream out of here. But y'all know it comes in such a big quantity. We do not like sour cream like that. But we will be making a lot of soup. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. It depends on my mood once I get in here, but I may just have Sim go ahead and run to Kroger and pick that up on his way home because he gets off at a decent enough hour. That way we can still eat dinner later. And I also took some salmon out because I'm thinking about meal prepping that. I know we only have a few days left before we leave for Augusta, but we can do for a good little meal prep so i think i may either prep that tonight or early tomorrow morning that way we can have it for wednesday thursday and friday this will always be my problem my attention span but anyway i need one of these for the kitchen because when i say standing up on that hardwood it's taking a toll on these flat feet as well as this back i'm thinking about getting one of these but do i want to get two or just one anti-slip relief support cushion support wipes clean and stain resistant non-curl edges sounds like i need it right y'all costco and sam's really be having the good clothes do not sleep on them like workout sets jackets like this fleece things of great quality and that's 19 dollars mm -hmm. is it very spicy or yes, just ma'am it is oh. how you doing thank you good I know y'all were telling me that the apple juice was a great deal the last time I was in here, but listen, with Sim and I, we will knock off all 12 of those within a matter of maybe two days. 
and that's ridiculous that's ridiculous because it's so good we'll just be pulling from the apple juice because it's there and we really don't need to drink it we need to be drinking some water so i'm gonna leave them right here in the store now this is some different looking wine it's called the georgian wine and i'm pretty sure that's a cork at the top wonder what that tastes like oh my goodness where was this when we needed this for Twyla's shower? This thing is huge. That is a $300 teddy bear. That probably would have been too big. See, I said I needed some K-Cups, but 120 of them? Yeah, no, I don't think I need that much. And I did have these, but I wasn't really a fan of the medium roast. I think I just need to move on down to a light roast because sometimes this can get a little bitter. Okay, a variety pack may more so be my speed. Dark Magic Hawaiian Blend, Special Blend, Donut Shop, which I like. Oh, Caribou Blend, is that what that says? And then this is a Costa Rica Blend. Okay, vibes. But see, honestly, I don't want to start up no bad habits with that coffee because I put it down for a while, picked it back up for Vlogmas, and girl, I be feeling jittery, so I don't think it's smart for me to get that big container. I forgot to give y'all the update. I ordered my mom's stuff for pickup, so I'm going to pick it up from the Dillard's location on my way down to Augusta. We're going to leave out Saturday. That's the plan. I'm not necessarily sure what time, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be within time that the mall is open because that's gonna be the 23rd. So I'll wrap it when I get to Augusta, but we are gonna work smarter, not harder because I don't have no discipline while I'm out here in these stores. And I'm also not about to be driving all around the world just to be picking stuff up from in store when you know what i'm saying online has always been the option especially nowadays you know georgia's steady building things up but can we get some more roadways please please or we need some type of underground transportation because the way these apartments and high rises are going up left and right and the traffic just keeps building on the streets we need to be flying like the jetsons before too late because girl just look at what i gotta look at every time i get in the car Look at this disrespect. Look at it. And you can tell that I tried to wipe it off, but it's just, <sighs> No, it's not about what you get in me. What do you want? Uh, anything simple, like a scarf, you know, the little barrette, like what mom had, like the burgundy one? Yeah. Uh-huh. Right, right, something like that. Okay, uh-huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's all the time. I don't go out, yeah, but you deserve to be spoiled, too. Your daughter rich, Grandma. Grandma, she be picking stairs at night. <laughs> yeah, Grandma, she done lost all that weight, so she be out at the strip club while Dad on the road. Yeah, I know. Don't let me say that because you got blackmailing. Oh yeah, we blackmailing her for sure. Baby, want something? She don't give it to us. She can get blackmailed. Yep. Oh, you guys. Uh, not an early upload this is early okay because if you know you know but yes your girl got this video up early tonight i just got done editing sim is home and before we break out that chili we actually have to go pick that stuff up because y'all know i wasn't able to get to it while i was out but now that it's still a little bit of sunlight outside we can go ahead and get things cracking so i'm just popping on to close out today's video thank you guys so 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 much for tuning in like always i appreciate all of your love and support especially during these last few vlogmas days so without further ado if you enjoyed today's video be sure to give it a thumbs up spam me comment down below hit that red subscribe button if you haven't already and don't forget to tap the bell so you don't miss notifications every time i upload i love you guys so much and i will see y'all tomorrow peace guys